Welcome everybody to Dream of Mike's Prayer. No, I'm gonna say whoop whoop. Let me hear you say whoop whoop. Okay, <laughs> whoop, then. Whoop. Here we go. Well, we had this old plantation that we visit once before. What's the name of it, Dream? Hopwell Broad, Hopwell Broadfield Plantation. Now you see why I got her to see. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, last time we was here, Dream caught an apparition on the camera, um, on the video. So we came to so we, we can do it again investigate maybe try to debunk some of the things we saw the apparition outside the uh window by the table and we also heard some voices in that area as well so that would like to communicate. Yeah, no one. Well, you got your phone right there too, though. Um, just... I don't think it was close enough to make it go off, though. I'm going to hold the phone in my hand. Mm -hmm. Are there any entities that yeah, could have been the phone? Are there any entities that would like to communicate with us? My name is Mike. This is Adrena. We would just love to hear your story. <clears throat> the last time we was here, we caught an apparition. So that apparition is still around. Could you please say your name? Could you let us know your presence is here? I have two toys that you can play with if you like to. Both of them have green and lights. All you have to do is come near it and it'll go off. That's really weird. <laughs> Could you bang on something or move something? Well, there's kids in this course. Could you knock on something like this? All right, it's been recording for three minutes, so I'm gonna stop it. You need to take out the speaker. Yeah. And that one. See the black mass? Mm. I wanted to Or it could be the shadow of that thing yeah. with a blanket on it. Yeah. Are you connected? Yeah. Okay. Are there any entities that would like to communicate? Yeah, no problem. You got your phone right there too, though. I'm gonna move it. I don't think it was close enough to make you go off, though. 
I'm gonna hold the phone in my hand. How about that? Are there any entities? Yeah, it could have been the phone. Are there any entities that would like to communicate with us? My name is Mike. This is Adrena. We would just love to hear your story. <clears throat> the last time we was here, we called an apparition. So that apparition is still around. Could you please say your name? Could you let us know your presence is here? Go back a little bit. After, can you let our... Can you let a, a presence... Pre let. Could you let us know your presence is here? Like a yeah? Yeah, that's what it sounds like, a yeah. It's here. Yeah, it does sound like a yeah. Like a yeah or something. Here. I have two toys that you can play with if you like to. Both of them have green lights. All you have to do is come near it and it'll go off. That's real weird. I don't know. <laughs> Could you bang on something or move something? It's not like you were getting ready to say something and you didn't. Like a burp. Yeah, play that back. There's kids in this quarters. Could you knock on something like this? for three minutes so I'm gonna stop it I think it'd be good to leave the camera rolling mm -hmm. and let's go out right. but did you get it from being dark though I'm just hoping that it won't play it how it's right. showing up on screen I don't know why it's showing so dark like that yeah. even with the light on it still shows dark so I'm thinking it's just the the way the screen is showing up so so we just did like a little short evp session in there because we only got like 30 40 minutes to waste and we're leaving our camera recording in there while we're walking around it is hotter than i don't know what right Monkey now nuts. but it is hot out here today <laughs> but so. also also uh when we came in we talked to the receptionist up front and she showed us some pictures of some wow. um apparition apparition that were caught out here and it's crazy because it's around the same area. Actually, it's in the back of the building, around the same area where Drina caught her apparition. Which is the slave quarters. We're standing in front of the slave quarters right, right now. But yeah, we're going to walk around real quick and uh, see if we catch anything else while we let our camera, stagnant camera play, a record in the slave quarters. So, Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, baby. Yes, yeah. thank y'all. Thank y'all all for the support. Thank you all to the new subscribers. And I hope y'all are enjoying these videos. We're trying to mix it up for you guys. So, uh, yeah, here we go. Follow the leader. <laughs> the leader is me. Well, unfortunately, we can't get in the house tonight because the tour for the house is closed. 
So we can't get into that. But at the end of this walkway is where the picture of the shadow uh, apparition. caught. And that's, actually that's the same window that Drina caught the apparition at, out of. Is that the building? Yep, that's the building. Yeah, it was at the end of a, uh, where there was a wheelchair ramp at. This is the only place where a wheelchair ramp is. Well, there's one right there, too. But, but it was this house. But yeah, was it was a long, yeah, the long. Yeah, it was long one out there. It's on the other side. Yeah. Okay, well, let's just walk through real quick. Damn, this is the house, and it was an uh, apparition of the owner, um, the, the slave master, of was a picture caught. inside of here that she showed us a picture of also. She had a picture of him. Then she had a picture of the apparition side by side. And it was definitely his him. His face, the yeah. reflection of his face was caught in a piece of furniture. Um, but yeah, we can't get in there today. And last time we were here, I thought I had caught an apparition upstairs or somebody that walked by one of the windows, but I was not recording in that direction. So be cool if we catch something on camera. So I'm just gonna do a quick walkthrough. Since they're getting ready to close in about five minutes. This over here was, um, I was told before, this was the kitchen area. If this isn't an original mirror, it looks like an original mirror. And just in case if anybody's run, wondering, this was a rice plantation. Um, and during the summertime, the, the owner, uh, master, or whatever you want to call them, they went north during the um, summers because the mosquitoes were so bad Malaria, so, was it malaria? Yeah, malaria, yeah. So they had to go north and they actually left the overseers in charge of the slaves while they left and went north for the summer. So the slaves at this plantation had a bit of freedom during the summertime in mm -hmm. a sense because um, they got to go fishing and just kind of like, you know, they had their, you know, of course, their daily chores to do. But after that, they had freedom to roam and do what they wanted to do a little bit um, back then. Uh, African Americans were uh, didn't catch malaria, so no, we're immune to it. Right, we're we're immune to malaria, so we of course that's why they kept the slaves behind and they went on and they went up north to escape. Right. I think she said this was one of the first houses actually with screens mm -hmm. um, to prevent the bugs from getting in the house, but the bugs are horrible out here. Yeah. But not only that, one of the main, uh, he's a descendant of the slaves, stayed not too far from here, and he was one of the caretakers. Did he pass? He did pass. Oh, he did pass? He, he kept volunteering. He was a volunteer at this plantation after it was a plantation, and he um, gave group tours, and this is what he knew. Right. And he did it up till the day he died. Yeah, the beauty of it that they had gave him land. He he got land not too far from him. I'm assuming that his family has it now. They said a lot of descendants from right. this plantation were given land. Right. Um, and so, they said they don't live very far from yeah. the actual plantation. So there's yeah. a lot of descendants in this area. of the previous slaves of this location anyway, that live close by. Let's take them to see this old car. See this old car sitting in the garage. Yeah, this is the refrigerator or the fridge. I'm not sure what it is. Is it?
Yeah, this was it. This was the meat cooler. The meat cooler. So it's still the fridge. Yeah. That's all in there. Spider webs. Oh. Here's the other side of the house there. Oh, look at that girl. What that is? Uh, that's some poke. Oh, See the red? Yeah, that's yeah, that's some red, that girl. <laughs> oh. But that's what it, the main house looked like. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Now look at this baby here, boy. I know Joey CTV would love this one. <laughs> oh, original, baby. Original. Yup. Oldsmobile. Olds, yeah. Oldsmobile. Look at that. This baby is original. And this was the last descendant, um, actual owner of the house, I believe, right? The lady who passed in the house. Yeah, I think so, home. yeah. Look at this baby. Jeez. That looks like nobody is driven. It has been sitting. It's just been sitting here. The inspection sticker says 73. Since 73. Huh? The inspection sticker right there on the window says 1973. Oh, uh, well, this baby still got the tag on it, yo. Let me see what the tag say. Georgia, 1970. The tag just says 1970. Mm. The colors. Yeah, they That'd be nice to see an apparition in there, Cause I'm sure she cherished this car, boy. I'm I'm looking at the car. I don't even see any scratch, scratch, scratches on it. Scratches on it. Scratches, yeah. <laughs> scratches on it. No scratches. Yeah. What happened? What'd you do? Is it still recording? Yeah, it's still recording, but it did like a little flash thing. Yeah, that's a baby there, boy. That's a beaut. And out in the field area. Yeah, the rice was. Rice fields were at, so that's awesome. Now, now here's here's a quick trivia for you guys. Rice was actually brought from Africa mm -hmm. to the United States. Yeah, so who knew that? So a lot of people thought rice came from came from China, but this. That's where a lot of rice, but that's where all the rice um, right. feels at. No. Yeah. You know that? Yeah, I know they have rice fields over there. Yeah, but it's out of the United States. limit our talking because last time we were here we caught some dang something bit me bad caught some voices and stuff this was an old horse ranch as well so there are a bunch of horse flies out here like, really bad
trying to focus on stuff. Let me say, bring no lighting. I don't know if I'll pick up. Yo, let me grab a light. Can't see nothing. I'm gonna grab a light. It's so dark in there. Mm -mm. That would be a negative, sir. Yeah. Wow, you still can't really see. You can kind of see, but not really. Maybe I need a flashlight. Let me try the flashlight. Alright. Okay. Alright, let's try the flashlight. He scared me. Ooh. That's what scared me. <laughs> I wasn't expecting anything to be standing behind the door. A big old human sized Santa Claus. <laughs> anyway, we're going to collect everything and get up out of here because um, we are actually past time. We're supposed to be out of here at 5 o'clock. Yeah, but she didn't say well, you could stay at the house this time. But, you, know. <laughs> you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna leave this recording as well. Just oh, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna put it up here somewhere. Actually, what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna have this facing the door.
you guys are saying what type of tree it is. That's just for this tree. But this tree was purposely cut into a bench. I don't know why they did that. Mm -hmm. I won't sit in it though. I'm not sitting in it, but I don't see if there's anything written in it. Mm. This is weird. They have a lot of trees out here that are over a hundred years old. Somebody had stapled something to it at one time. Yeah. A lot of these trees are registered. Registered trees that are over a hundred year old oak trees. So Okay guys, we gonna go get some fruit or something. I need some oranges or something, apple or some type of fruit. And get away from these horse flies because they's biting. They, they know that sweet blood. Oh yeah, sweet too. Hopefully. <laughs>